Hey guys, Dash here from keycommerce.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up Google Shopping shipping settings in Merchant Center. You need to provide Google with accurate shipping information so that it understands how and where you can deliver your products. Let's go through the setup together. Go to Google Merchant Center and navigate to the Shipping and Returns tab. Click on Add Shipping Information. Choose the countries where your products can be delivered to. Note that you can add multiple countries to the same shipping service. The company I'm using as an example is in Australia. So I'm going to put shipping within Australia. But for any other country, the process is the same. Click Continue. Now, select products that share shipping costs and delivery options. You can choose between all products or specific products. If you opt for specific products, you can select items based on labels you've previously assigned to your product data. These selected products will then use the same shipping costs. If you haven't done this, you'll see a screen like this appear. This means that you have to modify your data and add the labels according to the characteristics you want, such as price, promotion, size, and weight. I left a link below for more information about how to add the labels. The products will then be grouped according to these characteristics, as you can see here by clicking on Select Products with Labels. You can select the products you want by label and click Save. But for now, let's go with all products. Click Continue. Here, first, Determine what time an order can be placed. In the case of weekends or public holidays, for example, these days will be adapted. Then, determine how long it takes to prepare the product for shipment. Finally, establish how long it will take to arrive at the customer's home. You can check the total time below. If you change anything here, it will change there. Continue. Here, by shipping costs, choose your currency. Then, you will basically have three options. The first is that all orders to a particular country are free. In the second, the customer will pay for shipping. Then you can choose which factors will be taken into account for shipping. Same rate, price, weight, and carrier. And below, you can further customize each option if you wish. The last option is to offer free shipping above a certain amount, which you can add here. You can even add these last two settings together and set up shipping options according to what you prefer. After you're done, click Save, Review, and done. Some quick tips to optimize your shipping settings on Google Merchant Center. Regularly update your shipping information to reflect any changes in your business model or shipping policies. And try to offer competitive shipping rates to attract more customers. And if you can, offer free shipping. If you're going to charge for shipping, don't charge for shipping above a certain amount. This encourages people to buy more and avoid paying for shipping. And that's it! Your guide to Google Shopping shipping settings for Merchant Center. If you're trying to optimize your shopping campaigns to make more money, then check out our free Google Shopping course. You'll learn everything you need to optimize and scale your shopping campaigns all for free. I'll leave a link down below. If you found this video useful, hit a thumbs up and leave a comment below.